We are created in the image of a God who is loving and relational. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Amy Peterson. Amy writes, But if God has no beginning and no end and has always existed, what was he doing before he created us? How did he spend his time? Some precocious Sunday school student always asks this question when we talk about God's eternal nature. I used to respond that this was a bit of a mystery, but recently I learned that the Bible gives us an answer to this question. When Jesus prays to his Father in John 17, he says, Father, you loved me before the creation of the world. This is God as revealed to us by Jesus. Before the world was ever created, God was a trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, all loving each other and being loved. When Jesus was baptized, God sent his Spirit in the form of a dove and said in Matthew 3, This is my Son, whom I love. The most foundational aspect of God's identity is this outgoing, life-giving love. What a lovely and encouraging truth this is about our God. The mutual outgoing love expressed by each member of the Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, is key to understanding the nature of God. What was God doing before the beginning of time? What He always does. He was loving, because He is love. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Matthew chapter 3, verses 13 through 17. Then Jesus came from Galilee to the Jordan to be baptized by John. But John tried to deter him, saying, I need to be baptized by you, and do you come to me? Jesus replied, Let it be so now. It is proper for us to do this, to fulfill all righteousness. Then John consented. As soon as Jesus was baptized, he went up out of the water. At that moment, heaven was opened, and he saw the Spirit of God descending like a dove and alighting on him. And a voice from heaven said, This is my Son, whom I love. With him I am well pleased. That's today's scripture reading from Matthew chapter 3, verses 13 through 17. Let's pray. Thank you for your overflowing, self-giving love to us, Lord. We experience that in Jesus, and you'll never take that away from us. Thank you, Lord. In his name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.